Influencia. Please, if you haven't liked and subscribed, make sure you hit the button below and subscribe. So today we're going to be making a recipe. Today we're going to be cooking. Um, we're going to be making a simple recipe. I'm talking about your spaghetti and your minced meat. I mean, who doesn't love that? We grew up eating that and we grew up loving it, right? So I've got my ingredients here. I have my uh, chopped onions, ring onions, and I've got my green peppers i have my frozen mixed vegetables i have my spaghetti here as well and i have my ground beef mincemeat here with me and i also have my grated tomatoes i also have my spices i have my roger curry um it's mild and spicy. I mean, what's a meal without a curry powder, right? And what's a meal without your herbs? So I've got my mixed herbs here as well. I mean, what's a meal without Vista sauce? I have my Vista sauce here. And I also have my oils. I mean, we need that to cook. I have my salt. I'm a salt bay, guys. <laughs> and I'm going to also be using black pepper and for soup to make my mince a little bit thick i'm gonna be using a hearty beef soup and i also love to mix it with brown onion soup right so we are gonna be starting right we're gonna be starting with our spaghetti so come with me and let me show you the tips and tricks of how i prepare my spaghetti i mean you don't want your spaghetti to stick together you don't want that right so i'm gonna be adding my boiled water into a huge saucepan, right? And I'm going to make sure that I put my stove on six. And I'm going to make sure that I bring the water to boil. And So what I do is I know a lot of people a lot of people prefer to fry their mince. Well I don't prefer to fry it. I boil it first. So I'm gonna be adding my mince to a pan. So I'm gonna be adding my water, my boiled water in the mince. And I'm gonna make sure it comes to boil. And I'm gonna add a little bit of salt as well, just a bit. Okay, not a lot, guys. I know I'm a salt bay, but not a lot of salt. Just a little bit of salt, and I'm gonna let it come to boil. And also, guys, don't worry with the spaghetti. I prefer not to break it. So I just put it like this. And as the water boils again, it will automatically get in the pot, like all of it. So don't worry about this. After cooking uncovered for 9 to 11 minutes, make sure to stir to separate pieces and to make sure your pasta is well done. You can throw one piece against the wall or ceiling and if it sticks, it means it is well done. Now you can drain the water out of your pasta and rinse the pasta in cold water. That will ensure that your pasta is not sticky because we don't want any sticky situations.
so I'm gonna be adding half of my base stock So she's going to be tasting the food and rate my food out of 10. So let's see how that goes. Otherwise, the food presentation looks very nice, but she will judge. So <laughs> can you taste the food? Do you want to add sauce? Because guys, you can eat, you can, you can add your sauces. Our twins, tomato sauce and mayonnaise, they go well together. So... You can decide to add them as well as our aromat. I mean, what's a meal without aromat, as I said. So, yeah. Let's let Oratina taste the food. You can taste. Okay. Delicious. <laughs> Tell the audience how does it taste? Delicious. <laughs> what do you like about the food? Do you love the mince more? Do you love the spaghetti more? What do you love about the food? Orataan fela. Mince. Okay. Thank you very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Please make sure you like and subscribe. And I'm going to see you on my next video. As for me, let me go and munch on the food.